expensive Sportster or even bike that we have, this one here. Okay. So has this been service show? Like uh, it's been inspected. We do a 120 point uh, safety inspection. Is that Wilbur's? Hey. Is that Wilbur's? That's no Wilbur's suspension, but that's Harley, but it'll do. <laughs> so tires, all right, but they'll do. Okay, so what's the rear light? All right, can we have a look at the oil? Yeah, you want to set it on the stand. It is cold. Yep. So you always want to check it. When I just want to look at the colour of it. That's all. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, Colour's clean. Can we um? Can I take for a quick run? Can I take for a quick run? Uh, I'll leave you my passport and everything. Do you have your motorcycle endorsement? I do. Yeah, I'm allowed to. I've got my own bike that I had bought over. I'd have to see. You. I, I don't think it'd be a problem. I have to sign maybe a couple waivers, but it shouldn't be a problem. Because the problem is not having a, a, a California or United States motorcycle endorsement. Well, I do. Oh, right, you do? Right here. I can ride in the US, and that's the bike I can ride. It's Australian. So it means I can ride my motorbike. You can ride your motorbike, yeah. but the insurance won't cover for our motorbikes. Yeah, well, can I just go up and down the car park in the van? Uh, arguably, that's a lot more danger, or that's a lot more difficult than riding on the street just because you have such uh, a limited room, you know what I mean? Can I just start it up then? Yeah. Can I start it up? Let me uh, take it outside so we don't... Uh... And what sort of money are we looking at, Joe? I think we're asking 6400 US uh, plus taxes and fees. So it's the Evo motor, it's 211. Sounds all right. What do you reckon? What are you thinking? Start it. Right, should we do a deal, David? Yeah. Let's see if we can do a deal, yeah? Yeah. Joe, let's talk numbers. Let's talk numbers. Mate, we just want an all-inclusive. An all-inclusive. That, 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 that seems good to me. You happy with that? Yeah. Yeah. I actually really like it. It's just easier buying through a dealer because I can't get any money out of the bank. Um, yeah. So I'm just going to try and put it on my credit card. Oh, well, will they take that or not? I hope so. Obviously, we're trying to cut a deal here for the motorbike. He's talking, what was he, 6 6 plus 10% taxes, 12% VAT. So like about eight grand US, it's like 11,000 Australian. For someone that's done nearly 100, well, 40, 65,000 Ks on, it's a 12 year old sports star, it's too much money. Gotta try and buy the bike at a fair price because when David trades it in Cancun, they're gonna absolutely destroy him on price. They're gonna know he's gonna have to get rid of it, so he'd probably be lucky to get two grand back for it. So Joe's been great, he's given us the offer, seven and a half, out the door we've offered six out the door we're going to see if we can put a deal together hopefully bartels because we haven't test ridden it and as joe knows we're friends with matt we're just going to go to matt's do a deal there but hopefully we can just drive this thing and get on the road is that six grand with the motor <laughs> that's that 1500 off us six grand you'd be happy with that i think i might come back with six five have you learned any spanish au revoir I have. Um, hola, senor. Um, that's it. So Mate, you, should, you should have learned some Spanish. What for? You're going to Mexico. <laughs> that's what they speak there, Spanish. I'm oh, bonded too. Okay, we're waiting, waiting, waiting. 6k, so that's about 9k Australian at the door. If they want to offload it, they'll just get rid of it, you know what I mean? It might be just be a quick offload. Mate, they probably traded it for four grand, three and a half. They're probably going to make a quick two on it. I reckon they'll come back with six and a half. All right, gentlemen. Me in the middle, 65. It's up to you, Perry. I'll show you. You discount the bike 800 bucks. You do 65.37 out the door. Does it go to full tank of fuel? I'll, I'll make sure it does. Okay, I'll throw it Joe. All right, Cheers, deal's done. We've got a bike. We've got a bike, thanks. Fuck for that. Good man, Joe. Well done. Good stuff. Thank you, thank you. So we got a grand off, which I think is fair, 6,500. So Perry's car just got approved. So the Brother. bike is his. The deal is done. So the lady that did um, process David Finance was Mexican. She said one of the bigger issues you need to watch out for is the police. That the police, she said, will stop you and they will bribe you. How does it feel? Yeah, it feels all right, it feels all right. It's gonna do between five to six thousand Ks now. Shit, let's go. What's his name? 
name? Benji. Benji, you are beautiful. How old? Thank you. Eight months old. You're gorgeous. Yeah. And so is the dog. What? Me and David are going to have a race at the lights. You ready? The 1200 Sporty, which is lighter, against the big road king. Stage two. You ready for an ass kicking? arrived at San Diego Harley Davidson. A bit different. It's like we're in a warehouse. Yeah. David's gonna get a um, an open face helmet, aren't you? And I'm gonna get some boots, yeah? Yeah, have you got any idea what you're doing at those intersections? Because I, I don't really. What? Hang on. What'd have, you say? Have you got any idea what to no, do? No, no, you can turn right, you don't have to stop. Even at the lights, you can go still go right with the traffic. What about when I'm here overshot? <laughs> 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 We're finding our feet away. We're, we're still learning about the highways. We're not going very good, but we haven't had an accident yet, which is always good. <laughs> you, you money belt on? <laughs> <laughs> How cool is this? Hey! Wow! Wow! Look how huge this is! Oh my God! Look at this bike here, mate. This is the new um. This is a new CBO. It actually looks better in the flesh. That looks, that looks way better in the flesh. I paid out about the CVO colours, but that's been hand painted. That it looks, looks tough, mate. That's probably a bit too tough for you. I'm one tough bitch. Well, I've been through two pairs of Doc Martens and I'm donating these shoes to this lovely lady here. And I've finally got a pair of boots that are they're comfortable and they fit and I know they're not gonna give me blisters, which is good. So we're about to cross into Tijuana. We're about 20 minutes away. David, David, David. What? David, you got the money bag. Please. Yeah, they can take that one. <laughs> Let's see that one. <laughs> How much money? How much money's in there? I haven't got much. That's why I need to protect it, mate. Yeah, you can hardly notice that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I've had surgery. <laughs> <laughs> or a sea cup. Come on, let's fucking go. Let's go and get mugged, kidnapped, or fucking executed. Why are you nervous? Just give me a minute. Just Why a minute. are you nervous? No, it'll be alright. What are you nervous for? Fuck, my hands are so sweaty. <laughs> what from? Because you're crossing into Mexico. Yeah, come on, let's go. Let's it's quick before a, I change my it's mind. Just the murder capital of the world. Yeah, let's go before you know I change rule? my mind. If anyone chases us, what are we gonna do? Fight them. No, what are we going to do? What's the plan? Just ride. We're just ride yeah. it, ride it. Yeah, right, yeah ride go. like it's stolen. <laughs> ride, it, ride, ride it like it's an eagle rider hire bike. Let's go. Here, <laughs> right, let's go. So me and David are now leaving San Diego. We're about 50 minutes away from Tijuana. We're going to be crossing the Mexican border soon. Look at the traffic.
getting a bit louder, but yeah, it's uh, should be right. He thinks, he thinks there's something mechanically wrong with his Harley. Nah, no, it's just, just, just wearing in. Hey? It's just wearing in, mate. All right, all right, here we go. Okay, well, I think we're just close to crossing the border. And they just seem to be letting people through to the Eden. Maybe it's when you come. Maybe they let you go into Mexico, no drama, it's when you come back. Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? We're in Mexico. Senor and holler. No way, Jose. <laughs> no, no way, Jose.
you've got the cartel, plus you've got the, well, you've got the drug trade here. My theory is as long as you keep moving, you're safe. So we're coming back into Tijuana. We've got millions of people looking at us. Let's go. I think it's up here. I think this is where the hotel is. I've got no fucking idea. Guys, this the doors are locked. Hello, hola. 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 Huh? Hola. <laughs> hola. Uh, Daniel Hayes. I oh, yes, of course. For two, two rooms? Yeah. Gee, you're right in the heart of the action here. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> like, can I huh? You're not hidden at all. <laughs> well. This is one room? One room? Oh, yeah, I'll take this room, that's fine. And the other one is next to the How cool is this? Cool room. You got your own room, Perry. You're not in with me. Yeah, stuff hey? Stuff. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I'll, I'll... You're welcome, Mr. Hang on, hang on, one second. So we're in our rooms, and this is my room. Come in. Have a... hey. It's pretty cool. It's a cool. What's wrong? What are you stressed for? <laughs> no, it's weird, isn't it? It's a little bit weird. I feel it's... safe in here, though. Yeah, we're in this bunker. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> Hey, check it out though. Look, but, but this is cool. I mean, it's stylish. It's rich. Look how. Oh, wow. Man, it's all new. This is why I booked this. This is cool. It Good is choice. cool. Let's look at yours. Yeah. Good choice. Mate, I do my research. Mate, 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 look at this. Look at this down the end of the room. This is freakish. What the fuck is this? <laughs> that's an electric chair. No, that's where you sit. And unless you give them your money, they pull your tooth out one by one. <laughs> now <laughs> some weird some weird shit in this hotel where's your room oh this is nice oh yours is nicer i think the 
There's no bars on the window though. What, no. what, if, what if they come in through the window what? or something? There's no what? No bars. Don't worry about it. It's concrete. We're in concrete, mate. It's safe. And you know the good thing about the Harleys out the front? <laughs> They're gone. <laughs> We don't even need to worry about the bikes anymore because they've already been fucking stolen. <laughs> okay. How are you feeling? Yeah, great. Are you ready to get the town? Yeah. Okay, we've got codes to our room. Quick, let's go move the bikes there. Quick. Yeah, let's just move the bikes. We can do that shit later. Alright. Uh. Okay, we've got some safe, secure parking. Um, do you want me to put the lock on? Oh, it's steering lock on. Do you want me to put, I'm going to put my big lock on. Do you, do you want to lock your bikes in mine or not? Yeah, I think so. Go, go, gadget knife. Yeah. Do you think it's thick enough? What? Do you think it's thick enough? Yeah, well, <laughs> fuck it. Oh, fuck. Look at that, like a boss. It says what? Do you reckon that's necessary? What? That. Uh, Padlock. Does that say that? Yeah, I do reckon it's fucking necessary, uh, mate. Okay, yeah. good, good, good. Yeah, yeah, I own my bike. You're, you're, I mean, the fact that we're wearing twin t shirts, <laughs> I mean, and matching fucking hats, do you think that's necessary? So we've, we've been out for dinner, and the lady, everyone's told us to blend it in, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> oh, so funny. We thought we were playing. Well, because we're in the middle of Tier 1, and there's cops everywhere, yeah? yeah? People with machine guns, yeah? Yeah. It's full on, right? So we blend in, right? So we're thinking, we're blending in. <laughs> I thought we did a good job. And we walked back to our hotel and the lady that's been at reception, we said, how do we look? <laughs> and she said, I would take that off. You look like idiots. Pretty much she was saying we had a massive bulldog. Bulls like that on our backs were <laughs> She goes, take them off and just dress normally. Like, where does she think we are? It's only Tijuana. Okay, so everything you hear about Tijuana, sorry. Everything you hear about Tijuani is not true. I feel pretty safe here. So far, so good. <laughs> Been here like four hours. <laughs> Tijuani's good. And the, and the fish taco was good. Mm. The Tijuani in police? Oh, and the Tijuani army. <laughs> for those machine guns. Um, I feel 10 out of 10 for feeling safe. I probably feel about a six. Okay, let's take this shit off and put normal clothes on. Just heading out in Tijuani. Danny, you ready? Oh, I had to have a costume change. But you don't think I should have LA in there? Do you think people... No, just ha just do it how you had it before. That's perfect. <laughs> that's, that's, how you, that's how you're going to end up when they kidnap you. <laughs> so you don't know where you're going. All right, let's go. Roman streets are Tiji. All right, we're going back out to Tijuani. <laughs> 